Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel Masters in Selenium and I am your Ramesh Code Muru. Today we are going to learn step by step process to download and install Eclipse IDE on Windows. Let's start. So first of all open the browser. So I am opening the Chrome browser here and enter the website address www.eclipse.org. Okay. From, from where, from this website we are downloading the, our Eclipse IDE. Okay. on the right top corner you can able to see the option download button click on the download button okay so it will provide the option to download eclipse installer and ide packages okay so if i want to download i can download from here otherwise i want some other uh, packages to click on download packages okay so if you go, uh, scroll down you can able to see the download option now i want some other old uh, ide uh, packages so go for more downloads and you can see all the versions of the I eclipse versions here so you can see here that uh, 4.2 versions is available and uh, there is a link called older versions click on the older versions yeah you can see all the eclipse packages project releases so you can able to see the photon oxygen so you can select whatever you want okay so let's go back okay uh to our packages here so and go and download i want don't want the older version so this is the uh, version it's provided uh desktop ide packages just click on the download here or download yeah so now it asks us to select a mirror okay so Suppose uh, it is showing now it is showing for download from Japan, Japan Edward Institute of Science and Technology. No, but I want it so that there is other option to select it, select other mirror. Okay, so you can choose the mirror close to you. So it is go ahead all the uh, all the uh, universities or institutes which provide the Eclipse ID here. Okay, and we have button show all. So it will show all the uh, institutes or university which providing the Eclipse ID. Okay. So you can choose here so already i have uh, it is selected default japan so i not change any uh, do change any changes so click on download here yeah download so it asks to donate and in the meantime it is downloading the exe file so it is downloading eclipse installer gre exe file okay the size of the exe file is 113 mb so it download very fast uh, it depends upon your net speed we will wait till the exe is downloaded uh, eclipse installer ARE RTX file is getting downloaded almost completed yeah now go in folder so this exe is downloaded default in our uh, downloaded folder yeah so you can able to see the eclipse installer jre is downloaded in our download folder just click on that one yeah, so it asks it will open the file security warning and it asks to run the it has it is the exe file it asks to run okay just so it has opened the Eclipse installer. select the Eclipse IDE for Java developers so we have other options here 
so whichever the appropriate for option for you guys you can select here now i'm selecting the eclipse id for java developers okay so it provide option install folder if you want to change the folder you can change it and i want to keep the same default folder and just click on the install button so it asks to accept the terms and conditions so click on accept so installer installing process is started you can able to see that here the eclipse id for java developers it has all the essential tools for java developers including java ide it client xml editor maven and gradle integration The insert process is going on. This is showing the process and then depends upon net speed. Yeah, now installation completed successfully. Just click on launch. Yeah, you can be able to see the Eclipse IDE 2021 09. It's the latest version of Eclipse IDE I am downloading. Yeah. So it will ask to select a directory as a workspace. So it will take in default selected it here. Can launch. You can want to change. You can change the workspace here. Can launch here. So it is starting the Eclipse IDE. So it opens the Eclipse ID and it asks the options to select. So I uh, want to create a new Java project. So I click on this link. I'm creating a Java pro new Java project. So it, uh, it provides some project name. I say as a training. And it, it asks to select the JRE. So I'm selecting Java SC dot 1.8. It depends upon what type of version of JRE, JRE guys, your website in your uh, system. So select that one and finish. So we have created the project all the library files are downloaded the src and right button select new edit package save test i say test the java package has test as you know that java package the starting character should be smaller and then click on finish so package is created then select new and get a class class i saying a sample as you know that the class name should start with the uppercase so i'm uh, writing the s as capital here and i'm selecting the option uh, public static white main okay. click on the box here click on finish okay 
so we have created the project and created a package and created a class if i want to see like it or not what i'm doing system dot create a class and i'm going to click on this one say hello world okay save the project click on run so we created a class and we run the class here so now the input is hello world so successfully we have downloaded the uh, eclipse ide created the project created the package and created the class and we have run the, we got the output also so this is the way we can able to download and install eclipse ide in our windows okay so thank you for watching my video if you like this video please click on like button and subscribe to my channel thank you bye